Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven. It's Monday. It's Ladder Leverage Day, episode 78. And we got the man, Mr. Wasubi. How are we doing today, sir? Oh yeah, the man, the myth, the legend, yes, huh? Sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm glad to be back, man. You you know that I love my Shiru. And when you when you ask me if, if I want to indulge in some skirt, I was like, count me in, bro. Yeah. I, my jam. I, I just... Usually what I play is what I... Or I try to, like, counter everything that's in the top, like, four on the decks on yes. Play Gwent. And right now it's Commandos and Kung Fu Rabbit's uh, rat uh, thing list, the Plague Maiden list, which I, I enjoyed that list a lot, man. I thought it was pretty fun, man. Um, I mean, Shiru, Shiru against these Swarmy decks, yeah, it's it's just not a good time for them. <laughs> yeah, it, it usually doesn't work out for them. But, I mean, like, even still, if, you, if you're just killing, like, the... Two or three units? Yeah, if, if you're just getting, like, their core engines off the yeah. board it still hurts them man you know they just don't mm -hmm. have if they don't have that card they need to win round three or their bleed yeah. they're screwed i mean they're like screwed. obviously if you're hitting four or five units against let's say skelliga it's pretty common to get at least like a 20 point shiru and that's just game over yeah but like you said even if you just kill two or three engines it's, it can still be really good value yeah so and i mean like it it functions really well it's devotion so you know, like uh, mm -hmm. you said towards the end of the video here, you know, you're losing the heat wave and the um, the other things. But I mean, I, you're not I know that, that sad might sound like scary to some people, right? Because you know, you don't have the toll punishes, you can't banish the scenarios, ooh, right. right? But like, look, man, we have the Ethna, we have the Oak, we have so many points. And most importantly, this deck is a lot better in round one, right? Yeah. There's no all gods, there's no agitators, there, there's like no slow tempo carryover shenanigans. Right. We have all the middle of the pack, strong cards as well. Yeah. You know, the fraction needs, the, the trend board, the Danka. So a lot of round one power. Yeah, I'm not even sure Shino. how many games we won with this, though. I think we won 10 in a row. I'm almost yeah, positive. something like that. But yeah. it's, it's like you said, it, 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 it has the punch on red coin to where you could win on even. Or, but you don't have to, like, go nuts. Like, you don't have to spend your golds. Right. Like, yeah. you yeah. know, it, you get stuff like, uh, you know, Fretnex and um, Justice and stuff like that. But, I mean, you... You spend those cards, but I mean, like, Ethne is stupid. <laughs> it is <Yes>. stupid good. <laughs> like, it, especially when you have the Devotion package and she gets the symbiosis on top of it. It's like, yep. it's, it's it, nuts. In round three, like, okay, even if they kill one or two of those Dryads, you still have the big six, right? Like, right. good old Queen Ethna. Yeah, it's yeah. it's it's. I think it's a really really good list. I think if you're having a hard time climbing, we didn't run into any shield wall friends, but yeah, I'm... that can be. Yeah, Cause... I mean, you're uh, you you still have a way to approach the game there, like obviously, like try to win round one, bleed a bit, get out the the nukes like the Dolnimir and the Visigolta, right? Right. And I. I think then you're honestly fine because if you look at the deck, there's like no Gord, there's no Sheldon, you don't play into these Tall. duels and the Baron. So yeah, I mean I don't think it's that bad, honestly. Yeah, and if but yeah, obviously, yeah, you, you have to get out the Donimir, otherwise it's gonna get dicey. Yeah. And then um you know, if you are running up against like monsters or maybe even uh, in the mirror, you know, and you know that they're the the Gerald Heatwave version. Maybe try to not play directly into um, right yeah, Gerald yeah. with the TA. But <laughs> other other than that, I think you're I think you're good to go with this list, man. I like I said, uh -huh. I had no problems. Uh, I mean, granted, we ran into some extremely weird games that you're gonna see here, but uh, but like that that just goes to show you that this list can just cut through these ranks no problem right so if you're like trying to rank up towards the Pro last ranks. week of the season or whatever i i think this is a pretty good choice honestly because the main problem as as we were saying with the with the non-devotion version that plays for carryover 
is that it just sucks some blue coin, right? Yeah. Oh, Which, you almost automatically you know, lose unless it's like. Yeah, it depends, right? Like somebody that just drew extremely poor. I mean. It... Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, and th like this deck is more flexible in that way. So that's it, it. It just feels very good to play on either side of the coin. Yeah, can confirm. But a um, uh, couple games. I'll probably put a secondary game up. It was just a pretty much a blooper game. I'll put it up uh, separately uh, later on in the day. Um, um, definitely, guys, uh, keep an eye out on uh, TeamLeviathanGaming.com. Uh, we'll have a whole bunch of stuff going over the new cards once they all drop. Um, yeah. And then the um, when is... Uh, the next tournament masters or whatever the masters oh, masters are happening like the first weekend of december i believe so right before the expansion the expansion essentially yeah yeah, yeah. so you know definitely uh keep an eye out for that because we're gonna have a whole yeah. whole crew of people going in there we're gonna be like the power rangers how many people do we have we have five four yes. five yeah that's, that's i think that's how many power rangers there were it's been a minute but we're, uh, I, I think yeah. we're gonna. I think if if we ever had a shot to take one, this is the shot. Is it, yeah, we got yeah. we got all the the big boys going. So uh, get ready for that, man, because it's gonna be exciting to see. Oh, all it's people. actually four, right? Yeah, it's yeah, four. yeah. Green Eyed unfortunately didn't make it in the end, but it's it's Paja, you know, the winner of the last Grand Open, and then uh, Mr. Jams, Brother Jams, Cams. And then it's Saber and Gravish, right? Yeah, yeah from yeah. the so, crown so four points. Lots. Yeah, four out of eight, you know, still fifty percent of the <laughs> players. Yeah, it, uh, just to hopefully, hopefully, we don't have any like. Yeah, I mean, super... the competition is very fierce, right? Like you've got the the legend himself, Zemarcation. You know, his, his countryman Bangit, arguably equal good of a player, and yeah. then then you've got Colamon and Tailbot, so. Oh boy, oh boy. Yeah, Tailbot, Tailbot's always fun done. to watch, man. The dude's just like... Yeah. It, yeah. It, it, it's always like watching Drago from Rocky, man. He's just stone-faced oh and just... <laughs> I love him, man. I fucking uh, love it him. It really is like that, though. Like Tailbot and Coleman, those those are some household names from like the very, very old days. For sure, dude. So, for sure. Yeah, always, always. It's gonna be some hard preparation to do for sure. Yeah, but, but I, you I, know that's that's the nice thing about having a team. So we're gonna try our best. We'll just see. Yeah. But uh, here's a couple games, guys. Like always, thank you so so much for watching. We'll see you at the end. Weird though. Gerald bomb chucker. <laughs> yeah. the, the brand new Geralt. People want to see the Quen come back, but we want to see the Geralt that throws the bombs. Right. Mm. Oh, we, well, I mean, we have the justice, so we probably just toss the volunteer. What about this hand? We can. Well, we don't have the. It would be nice to have the. What's yeah, I mean, we, we can just boost the fall day, that's fine. Maybe we keep this, don't want to make the hand too good. If anything, we would like Mulligan the Ethna, but there's no point. Don't have Danka anyways. So what's he go with? Boat? I would imagine, yeah. And he TAs it, and then um, we basically don't really have to contest the round. Oh, what? Okay. Now oh, that's new. <laughs> right? Yeah. Did we just bleed it? Mm, yeah, might as well, sure. Play the oak critters. Right. So now he knows where devotion basically, uh, which is fine though. Not really a compelling reason to delay it or anything, right? No. Maybe should have played that back row. Nah, yeah, I mean, just play the cards. Fine. If I go down, so what we'll play? You could play with me. Maybe like uh, Caress and maybe like... Uh, oh, well, Caress could be good against the Raiding Fleet, right? Yeah, the boat. Mm. We just I play mean, the Fretnex, huh? 
I, I would actually keep maybe, I don't know, like if we draw the Danka. Nah. We would just go Justice. Then the volunteers and. Uh... Play the Embacro though, huh? Sure, yeah. Flip the rolls a bit. Leave it to us. Oh, this is a weird deck. With like a War Crier. I guess he just has a One two of... bolts. And a war cry or something, yeah, yeah. Mm. Uh, yeah, I don't know. It's probably just better to play the another bolt. Yeah, not sure. Protector is probably probably gonna play a protector next. Mm. If he's like damage, self damage. Yeah. Hmm. Uncreate more order. Okay. Let us put our steel to the test. Those are some weird cards, my dude. All right. uh, so... If we play the Frexy and try pushing a bit, he's probably just gonna Blood Eagle the Dryad, right? Uh, oh yeah, if we but, play it. Yeah. So I'm thinking maybe just like... Well, but that's fine, because then, if he uses Blood Eagle round 1, he has to make a decision if he wants to bleed with it round 2, or just save it for round 3, and we win the round 3, right? So, yeah, I, I think we can just go ahead and boost the fall day. Uh, yeah, it's it's a bit sad not to have the Danka or the <laughs> other drive, right? But, but, yeah. yeah, it would have been nice. Mm. I mean, fall day with plus 2 is like... Pretty decent in some situations as well, but yeah, he blood eagles now, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Which is good though, because again, God, this is the first God. use, and then he cannot really. So what does he play here, though? Yeah, probably just an engine. Oh. Now oh, this is a very interesting deck. It's got to be wild boar. Hey, hey. I I don't know, maybe. <laughs> Is this where we jump maybe. out? Yeah, I I mean what's the reason to continue? Yeah. Like let's say we uh hmm. So Rebuke is a seven, puts us to I mean I guess we could continue, but I really don't see the point. Just jump out. Unless, unless he's like Covenant of Steel, Dagur, kind of a cheese or something. Mm. The damage is kind of apparent, huh? Yeah, it's it's a bit suspicious, isn't it? <laughs> Play a couple more. Uh, yeah, we could try to maybe just play the caress and see if. Just play it on whatever. Maybe deny bloodthirst. Yeah. Play it on the... Ah, yeah, okay, it's fine. It doesn't deny anything, but... I mean... Yeah, he already this, played... this, this... He, already played he might feel good about this pass now. He might he might just take it. Pretty sure. So we play... We have to play Protector, then. No, I mean, you, you can just play two cards, right? You can play, like, the Trend Boar and the Rebuke, maybe. So that's what, that's like uh, 7 and then a, so that's 40, yeah, that's always enough, yeah, yeah, I think we just played those two. Trent Bourne what? And then the Rebuke, uh. right? Yeah, it's, uh... that's fine. So we get our long round, uh, not sure if we're getting Defender cheesed or what, but I mean... Guess we'll have to see. <laughs> yeah, not having that that heat wave hurts. Oh yeah, but I mean we have them points, so you know maybe just power through it anyway. Okay, mm. tempering is good with the Ethna. Maybe we mold the dwarfy boy. Yeah. Oh. We're back to square one. <laughs> uh, yeah. Fuck. So what do we... Okay, so we have... 
counsel for the Shiru, call for Danka or the... I mean, we, we have pretty much everything, right? Ideally, we would draw the other Buke, I guess. We, we just want some nature cards, ultimately. Just, uh, yeah, that's not good. That's okay. Oh, this is gonna get dicey, isn't it? Yeah. Well... I think we have to mull the Shiru. Well, I mean, we still have the miners as well, but I mean, having a bricked sentinel is not the end of the world. I think you should take the mulligans, and if you get the other sentinel, it's like whatever. Oof. Alright. Yeah, yeah, I mean, sure. It's. We missed the, the call. We just dunk, uh... Well, oh, we he there, did right? have it too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, it's, it's we just like, we so... just kill it now, right? Can we? I mean, what's the rush, honestly? If if it's defender, we can't. We're fucked. <laughs> or if it's two blades, we're fucked. Nah. You don't I, think? I, I don't. I don't think it matters, honestly. Like, uh, maybe it does. I don't know. I don't. I, so what do we... We could play the Dryad that deals damage, maybe? The Guardian. Sure, yeah. Enye! Enye! That way... Uh, I mean, he might just kill her. I don't know. But if he doesn't... Okay. I Wait, think... what could he be? Ah, yeah, just resist this. So he wants to, like, make a big Dagur right away, I, I suppose. Oh. That doesn't even get him there, though. The yeah, that's not good. <laughs> oh, Harold does. Harold does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, like, now we could just be annoying, right? Mm, one thing I'm worried about, though, is if, if we, like, Kill the Covenant and he has Sigdrifa or something. True. <laughs> yeah. So let's say we play a minor. Okay. We could we could maybe just fall the ah. Mm. We know he has Blood Eagle. We could just uh, delay a bit, right? Play the minor, see what he does. That's fine too. Never, yeah, because like break. basically we want to set this covenant to a five and just burn baby burn. Uh, but it's not gonna be easy. <laughs> yeah, I think this defender is gonna fuck us. Nah, no, nah, no, nah, nah. it's 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 have to be a bit creative. That's all. What? This? So the miner actually lives, huh? Okay, so we could pull the Danka with the Fove, that's, that's fine. Switch the Rosa, Wasting... huh? Yeah, sure, yeah. So Fove into Danka? Mm-hmm. Watch him have, like, a Flaminica now. <laughs> <laughs> we have already experienced that once, haven't we? Yeah. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> All right. Do we boost so we the can... Fav or do we boost the Danka? I think the Danka, but I also think you use the Danka. I mean, you could wait a turn. I don't think he can deal with it. No, he, he's gonna have to use. If it... I'm wrong, though, we could have trouble removing the Covenant. Wow, he are you serious? Yep. He's just gonna champ it. Oh my God, this guy. No respect. Oh. Oh. Interesting. Wait, what is that? Ah, okay. Wait, but you're literally giving us more fives, man. Oh no. Ay, ay, ay. I mean. Do we take it now? Oh, we can't bust. Probably, probably. Yeah, probably. So we just use the leader that gets it to five, right? Uh, or... that gets it to six, but you can use a... a leader ping. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. 
Like we burn three targets. Yeah, that's okay. Why the hell not? Yeah. The only good human is a dead human. I mean, it's decent value. It's not that bad. Yeah, he loses his that... Shiru engine. We got the the Marauders out. Mm -hmm. uh, also, keep in mind that he played Blood Eagle, so like actually the Ether now is safe, likely somewhat. to do some work. Yeah, I mean we still have three Nature cards. He has another Raider too, possibly. Yeah, 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 that's true. I mean we can maybe play the Miner first. Really, Madman wow. first. <laughs> Now, now, this guy is playing like an interesting block. He's, he's that. got wild so boar, he has to. Yeah, so, we so just... now he has champion's charge. Uh, I, I think you just go with the ETH now, yeah. Sure. We have last say with leader, so like if his wild boar, he doesn't get to damage the sentinels, which is nice. Unless we really have to kill something, then... Uh, I, I can still, like, I don't know. I don't think he has uh, two blades, right? Like, he would have played it ages ago. <laughs> yeah. But uh, there could still be something. I so he could, like, champions charge this seven, but... What? Ah, uh, that's a bit early, my man. I don't know about that. Yeah, how does... I don't know about that. So we just go tempering? Or do we go... Yeah, tempering on the, one of the drives, I think. That's fine. Yeah. Uh, now the points start coming in on our side as well. We had a bit of a delay because of the Covenant situation, but... Right. <laughs> it's, it's finally starting to kick in. Plus three on every nature card. Oh, he goes for the RNGA. Don't. Ah, the first shot. The first, the very first one. <laughs> so we just go minor. Um. Why is he stacking too? Interesting. Interesting, interesting. So he has two Bloodthirst. What cards uh, rely? I mean, how important is the denying the Bloodthirst? I don't think he has like more bloodthirst cards. Well, he could kill the Ethna with a Skiordle. He might have uh, what's his name? The guy that turns to an eleven with three bloodthirst. Oh yeah, but uh, I mean yeah, playing the miner is fine. Yeah. Oh, I'm feeling sleepy, grumpy. Oh, Svanriga. Yeah. Yes. 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 I was thinking like, wait, do you mean Voltcarl? And then I was like, oh, you mean what? <laughs> What is going on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, 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 it's just awkward, yeah. Yeah. So we just kill it. Sure. I mean, we can play Protector, right? We do have a Rebuke. But we give him more Hemdall targets. That's all right. That's all right. I, I don't. I don't think we have a Rebuke in the. Yeah. Yeah. We played it round one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What the? Just, uh... What is going on? No, not sure, not sure. Uh, I mean, he had a defender on the board, he could have... I mean, I still think we could have dealt with it. Uh, also, we can boost the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Make her six. And then... Denying the bloodthirst in the process. The last save this... with Oak. If, if he wins be... this game, I'm gonna be super pissed, because he played this game nah, like absolute didn't... fucking garbage. <laughs> 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 I don't say that yeah, too yeah, often, yeah. but... The, the, the sequencing is a bit off, I think, yeah. So we had, there's a couple of threes. I'm not really worried about his leader. I think you can take a ping on the on the six just to get like full value rebuke. Yeah, I think it's perfectly fine to do. Uh, we should always be able to get the sentinels out. Like Yeah, there's, there's three, three twos on the board or three. Yeah, there's so many three threes. threes. Yeah. He didn't even get the yeah. champion's charge! Oh, but he had it the whole- he could've just killed the E- oh my god, okay. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, that was garbage. Yeah, it was a painful game for uh, him, for sure. Wow. Alright, 
let's right. let's try again. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's Mars. Ooh. Okay. White Ooh. frost. Rules are for those mm. who would otherwise incinerate interesting, themselves. Interesting. All right. Oh boy. Here we go again. Um, yeah. So it's probably volunteer, volunteer, Shiru, just take the simple moves, I suppose. Alright. Okay. I mean, we can work with that for sure. Um... Do we just play the Dunka now? Well, it's just gonna get moved, right? Well, yeah, but she's still boosting, even if in the back row. Right? We give her so... TA, or...? Sometimes. Yeah, we can, we can. Yeah, we can. I mean, there's no Manticore to be afraid of. Geralt? So... Vanilla? Well, I mean... Sure. Don't care. <laughs> I don't think we're losing on even to Geralt. Maybe, maybe. But... Imagine treating your opponents with respect. So... Not on this channel, baby. No, not today. <laughs> There it is! <laughs> yep. Like, let, let's just play White Frost with Geralt, right? That makes perfect sense. So now um, we, now so we go now. Minor. Mm -hmm. Probably like Minor into, like into Abbey, into Boar, Justice. Yeah, I mean, I, I think we're perfectly fine. But yeah, like, obviously you play the Geralt in a Frost Leader. It's just... Great. Oh, oh, we also know he's not Devotion, right? So, like, what doesn't he... Do he doesn't have Thrive on Winter Queen? Like, what is this deck building? Uh. <laughs> it's so... It's so freaking bad. Okay, so we go... Yeah, yeah, we boost this up, and then we have Trendbor to actually kill one of those, combined with the damage. Yeah, so that's pretty neat. I'll take it. Uh, yeah. Oh, there we go, the Nagrafar! Oh. Ah. Huh. I wonder if that's better to kill. Eh. I want to say no? I don't know. Maybe we just rebuke it, yeah. We can kill one of these larvae now, I guess. Yeah. Turn they are bound to grow big. And the nice thing about us it, it takes is... the damage. Yeah, exactly. That's like pretty neat. Unless he has a way to like well, he could also move it to the back row, but that gives us another charge. Right. <laughs> oh man, Trendbor is such a such an annoying card sometimes, right? It's a problem, child, if you don't have the answer. Mm-hmm. It's almost like if Botchling boosted by two, it would be in the same boat. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, I, I, I miss Botchling. Yeah, it used to be just... I, 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 don't, I don't think these uh, seven provision patient, patience engines he ever really... He did move it. Paid. Bro. But that's not good. Oh, wow. Look at this guy, so smart. <laughs> And the winner queen. The winter queen. Yeah. So we go justice. So we... Um. Yeah. 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 Sure. Okay. We could justice, stack the front row a bit, and if that doesn't give us the pause, we can go like maybe, maybe tempering. We'll see. I mean, okay, but like, look, he played a larvae. He played his girl. Winter queen came out. He played his white frost charge. Like, isn't this so bad for him? I, I don't know. I think it's, like, really bad, actually. And if he plays Eager now, he's just gonna get rebuked, right? Oh, he just, just plays this. Okay. Does oh, what is he moving? One of, one of the fours, I would imagine. This shielded hole. Oh, God. So we just pass, right? Yeah. I... Uh, yeah. I... <laughs> oh, yeah, we're going up against two engines. Three. Basically, yeah. I mean, he. Sh I think he should have moved one of the floors, honestly, just get ahead. I, I don't know. What does he think? We're gonna keep fighting, or what? I mean... Yeah, not sure, not sure. This Shiru should be... good. 
like given the cards. What? Uh, so okay, he so bricked he gets... that. Well, yeah. Uh, he so okay. So he gets it in round two. He's probably gonna try to bleed us. So. Well, he used one we... movement tool. Mhm. Mm Would be nice if we don't break sentinels and Shiru. Hey, I mean, do we take these mulligans? I, I don't think we can really take mulligans. What's left in the deck? Uh, what do we miss? We can call the Ethna. We're basically on the Miss Frexy. Yeah, I mean, I think this is good, yeah. Like, like I said, I think we only Is this good enough to beat the win around, though? Oh, yeah, yeah, I think so. But, like, is, isn't the only loose condition and ending up with a bricked card? Ah. Uh. And, like... Yeah, okay, that's, that's fine. So here's the question. Do we take it slow? Or do we just slam the Ethna? Hmm. I think it's okay to maybe, like, play Oak Critters first. That's what I was thinking. Yeah, and if he gives us something worth rebuking, we still get the plus two, which is very nice. Thing is though, these fours might be our lead, our Shiru, but I mean, I don't think losing one four is such a big deal. <laughs> now he's like, how do I beat these Oak Critters, man? I right, move one. <laughs> it uh, dies. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. The, the leader is just a bit sad. Let, let's not lie to ourselves. Yeah, it needs uh, it needs a passive of some sort. Any maybe any of the movement ones need a passive of some sort. Yeah, like uh, because again, like all... if you give it three charges, it's, it's maybe a bit too strong and like I don't know. It's probably what? Yep. I told you, man. He cannot beat the oak critters. Oak critters are too good. <laughs> we saved the temperings, right? Well, I mean, what else do we play though? Like. We, uh, yeah, we kind of have to. I, uh, like, look, it's not like we have dwarves to give armor to anyways. We have, like, one miner, right? Yeah. That's it's fine. He just wanted to I... him, huh? Uh, well, I think he thought about bleeding, but his hand ended up being really bad against... Well, one of, them's, against his... one of them's the frost, for sure. Mm, yeah. I think his hand is just awkward against these oak raiders, honestly. That's probably what it was. Did we drop Okay, one? so uh, what do we call for? Uh, minor. Ah, okay, so then we have to keep this. Yeah, this hand can only get worse. Yeah. So we start with Fretnex, huh? Mm -hmm. Boost the uh, Ethne. Oh, yeah. All front row, huh? Uh... Sure. Sure. Or do we go all back row? I mean... It makes his leader kind of... Well, it doesn't matter, huh? It doesn't matter, right? Like, he has the art gun anyway. He's gonna have one more movement for sure. Well, okay, so he has a leader charge, and then he's probably gonna have the Wild Hunt Bruisers, they are called, I think. Yeah, he already used one, though. Oh, he did? Yeah, okay. So he still, could still have one more. And he has the... The double frost, yeah. Card. Art gaze. Keep in mind he's non devotion, so right. There could also be some kind of a heat wave or whatever, but doesn't matter really. If he has the Oberon, it's where we're gonna hopefully profit. Oh yeah. I mean, I think we rebuke it regardless, just to kill the engine and then. Yeah, we'll see, we'll see. We rebuke Ooh. that, huh? Okay. Or does so he just use it off rip? You... He just uses it off I, that. I, I think he should. Yeah, that's a mistake. I think you're supposed to just kill the dryad because now it just gets rebuked, right? Ping it and just rebuke it. I mean, okay, the death ball doesn't matter. We don't have a tree end, right? But... Wait, no. I was like, why is the armor still there? <laughs> yeah, it's a bit slow. I was like, wait. <laughs> Yeah, so what could be interesting game is if he has like a random row punish, like Lacerate, 
So let's say like we're we cat. The... Yeah. Okay. So now we go so ethnic. Because like. Yeah, let's say we play this Ethne front draw and then we get less rated, then we're actually looking at the game of Gwent, right? But I mean We can go uh, we can go Fav into Call into Minor. Mm. And then boost one. But he just moves it, right? But then his movement's gone. Yeah. I, I think just playing the we could also play the Ethan in the back row. But then he can move the three and the dryad dies. Eh, I think it's the front row is fine. Like I, I don't know. I, uh, yeah. Being worried about some random lacerate in a Triss lacerate. Here she comes. I'll be yeah. instantly oh, off yeah, of yeah. Team Triss if I. <laughs> <laughs> oh no no. Don't even say that. Uh, I mean, we have four engines, man. Like, this is crazy good. Oh god, is it Triss? It oh, is it's he actually. Are you serious? Yeah. Please. Yep. Oh my god! Oh, this is monkey deck building. Oh my god, okay. Oh, he Does must he be so proud too? of himself. I mean, he loses the game still, right? But that was juicy. Wow. So we go Fav. Uh, in the minor. Then he moves it. I, I I think we just like play the tempering. On the f yeah. on the on her. I right? would be maybe afraid of a heat wave a bit. Yeah. So just Could on the fret this. next. Yeah, 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 sure. Oh. Uh, what is this clown deck building, guys? Like, look. I play White Frost with Geralt, and I also play the Lacerate. And I just kill everything. <laughs> okay, so Ethan dies. Good job. I uh, guess we go Oak Critters. Front row. Just lead the, yeah, just kill the two. No, 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 no. That's our Shiru, sir, potentially. Oh. Yeah. Don't give him the win condition now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, we, we still kind of need to hit a respectable one. If, uh, yeah. We can either call it or we can cancel it. But yeah. So again, we were probably supposed to play the Ethan in the back row. Yeah, I guess it wouldn't have been that bad, right? Because they're gonna. Well, it doesn't matter, right? Because then he just moves the two with Frost, and he less raids anyways. Like, I, I, is is this the best Shiru? Uh, like we could probably. wait a turn. Uh, Maybe we just kill this just so it doesn't. Oh, you mean like hit protector? It. Yeah. Okay. Because it's gonna hit us for an extra three, right? As long oh, as it's yeah, on the board. Yeah. Hmm. Do it. Not sure about this Shiru. Maybe we're just supposed to take it, honestly. Take it now, huh? Yeah, like a 10 is okay. It's nothing to scoff at because he, his side of the board has zero points then, right? He didn't play Oberon yet, though. Yeah, that's all right. Like, that's that's our rebuke, I think. Yeah, this is fine. It's oh, fine. Uh, because, like, look, he has, he has no points, right? Uh, true. I mean... We lose two, we have five ourselves, which is not the greatest, but... I mean, these three upcoming cards are pretty decent, so... I don't know, man. It's still gonna be close. Oh, he's leaving us our thing. That's nice of him. Yeah. Alright, so then we just rebuke this five, I think. Oh, you could... Yeah, okay, yeah. You could also minor. Yeah, 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 sure. Or we could just take some other nature. 
uh, what's in the deck still? Caress, uh, rebuke and, and caress. Rebuke. I mean, we could rebuke this five. I don't see why not. With five? Mm hmm. Yeah, I mean, we have two trades, right? To 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 play. Yeah, it's decent. I mean, if he has no points, it's gonna be difficult to win. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. Uh, we do have like tempering in the grave, so we don't have to be worried about proactivity. I don't. I think it's not even close if we don't TA that Dunka. Oh yeah. Well, I don't know. Like you, you don't really. Respect Triss him. lacerate. Oh my God, man. He might not hit okay. it. Just... This is like certified clownery at this point. This is like. Clownissimo Maximo, man. The, the... So we just take the Triss now, huh? Or the the Oak now? The... Uh, the, yeah, I mean, we first protected the... So here's the question. We probably just tempering, right? Do we? On the one. Mm-hmm. Still back row, though, right? Yeah, yeah, we can stack, sure. Because we need targets for like our leader, and I don't know. I, I just, I just think keeping the trees alive is fine. Now he's gonna scorch us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, guys, I will shit my pants if he scorches us. <laughs> oh god. I think Here you're right. Go. I think it's heat wave. I think it's gonna be a heat wave. Yeah. That's why I want to keep the Triss alive, because that's that's that could be our leader. Yep, it's heat wave. Yeah, there we go. Okay. I mean, there's no way he can beat this. So, so. we ping here twice, and then just yeah. go positive, huh? Yeah, yeah. I mean, we can hit the... Hit the one. Whisper. Yeah, zero points on his side of the board. <laughs> so this would make the Oak... A nine, we don't lose to Geralt Professional. We play so. it here, right? Oh, yeah, 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 right, right. So it makes it an eight. Yeah, what am I talking about? Man, what what a... Like, I know people get angry with me when I, like... <laughs> Make fun of other people's decks and yeah. shit. <laughs> no, but, like, seriously, this is just a bunch of nonsense, right? Like, it's a bunch of non-synergistic garbage. But, I mean, sure, like, whatever, <laughs> the guy... The guy is trying something new, right? Like he's being creative. Right. I, I guess I should applaud him for it, but no, like it, it just ah, it's not coherent in any way, guys. Like, come on. Yeah, it, it's uh, it's a guys. bunch of it, it, it. Me and you had this discussion yesterday with lockdown. It's the same thing. Like you, you, yeah, you play a bunch of cards that are good, but in the end, you just don't have enough points. <laughs> yeah, like right here, the same thing. Like I was all about lockdown, and then we played it yesterday. And I'm like, he played Shiru, uh, uh, what's her name, uh, Radea, all this, and he still lost by oh, like yeah, 15. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, like uh, yeah, he had ball, <laughs> like all this stuff. I'm like, what is going on? Yeah, like that's the thing, right? I mean, he didn't even play giants. Like you need points on your own side of the board, right? Yeah, even as like sure you you can Gerald us, you can Heatwave us, you can play three less raids, and like all of these cards found amazing value, but like you don't have it's points, enough, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you just don't have points. Wasubi, thanks for recording, sir. Another episode of Laver Leverage. Uh, we'll have some new toys to play with um, here soon very enough. very soon. So uh, yeah, it, it'll it'll get a little bit uh wild here soon but until then oh, you know yeah. if you I gotta mean, climb if you gotta climb i think this list will get you there no problem i, I don't think oh, we've yeah. lost with this list yet yeah i think we're on like a 10 game win streak or something yeah I, so yeah it's it, pretty good yeah it'll it'll take you where you need to so check it out um like always guys thank you so much for watching um we'll probably probably once all the cards are revealed you guys are going to do like maybe a review Mm -hmm. probably and then uh, I think so yeah that's what we usually do or like I a... mean so far the, the direction the expansion is taking is quite interesting so should be should be a lot to talk about yeah I think they're showing a lot well I, I, I think they got the 
Hearthstone-y cards out of the way, and now they're you know, yeah. you're going to start getting the, good ones. the consistency. <laughs> Honestly, though, man, I'm not going to lie. I think uh, Movement ST is going to be really good. I think it's going to yeah, be sweet, the, the, man. The, the Cat School Witcher is what we already saw, and that's pretty good. Well, that uh, that Bren card uh, is, gives movement a finisher now. You can play that oh, card, yeah, 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 mo right. one movement, and that card's dead. <laughs> right. So that's huge, man. That's absolutely yeah. huge. That's what yeah. it really needed was it's like a bomb of some sort. Before it was just like, well, you got to hope everybody plays into it. Like, I mean, I, I, I still don't think we're going to end up seeing like Gorilla Tactics, good old Brewer, you know, but maybe, maybe. You, I, you I, I think it's getting a rework, dude. I think... May oh okay. I think there's six leaders that are getting a rework and they're gonna have okay. their own now, that tree. Would be interesting. And that I would be interesting. I think Gorilla like Tactics. If they, if, they, if they buff the movement leader and print all these movement cards, then Squirtle is looking at like a completely new way to play the game. So that's certainly interesting. Yeah. I, that's that's what I'm predicting. I think they're gonna show it at the next thing. Is oh, uh, I hope you're right. You uh, know I love me some Ruger. <laughs> six six new leaders coming. I'm telling you, dude. They are, well, they're not new leaders, but they're gonna get revamped and they're gonna be awesome, man. I think Devil with some uh, with some insider leagues, huh? <laughs> I think dude, that's what I'm just. I don't know anything, man. I really don't. Right? right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I so. I'm just going by what um, Slama said with the the young lady that he had on that. Uh, oh yeah, did yeah. The, the yeah, cards, and she said there's seven new trees coming out by the end of the year. Mm -hmm. And they already showed one. You got the next leader tree. I think, I think there's going to be. Well, that's already five. So maybe only five leaders get reworked because Skellige doesn't need a rework on any of their leaders. Uh, so possibly, but that's what I'm. I predicting. mean, like arguably Skellige has a pretty good variety right now, which mm -hmm. is surprising, right? Mm -hmm. But it's not just warriors, right? You see the alchemy deck with Gadineath with Battle Chance, and yeah. you also see some. Urson ritual, like usually Lippy right. shenanigan. So yeah, even like, even the rain's not horrible. Right. Yeah. I mean, arguably, it's, it's yeah. if it had, you know losing that extra charge hurt, but yeah. I mean, I but again, like it's I, I would love to see you know the weather actually mattering. You know, maybe some kind of a two blades deck. Oh boy, I I miss my guy. <laughs> he's coming. He's coming. But. um Thanks for watching, guys. Check out TeamLeviathanGaming.com. We'll have some stuff there shortly. But uh, yeah, I mean, obviously, still, if if you have some climbing to do, then you know this this deck is as good as any, especially on these numbered ranks. You know, yeah. you just you just have so much value. You have the control tools that are necessary. You know, obviously, you sacrifice the heat wave and the Gerald and whatnot. But you know, you have the Oak. So yeah, it's, yeah. it's good enough. I'm a fan, but. Um... Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.